Well, if you are rushed to a hospital that's in your insurance network, you would assume that you would not wind up with a large doctor bill. A local woman was shocked by a huge bill for treating her husband and says that's just not right. She turned to local 12 troubleshooter Howard Ain for some help. Brett Wall suffers from locked-in syndrome following a stroke. As a result, although he can barely move, he's able to think normally. As you can imagine, this has been very hard for Brett and his family, so they were quite upset after receiving a large doctor bill following an emergency room visit earlier this year. He, we thought we was having a seizure. We called 911 and he was rushed to Mercy Anderson, which is an in-network hospital. Gail Peyton Walls is Brett's wife. Brett is home now following a full day of monitoring at the hospital. He's able to move a little bit so he can type and talk with a machine. Recently, Gail received this bill for more than $1,200 from a doctor at the hospital, a doctor she had never heard of before. She called and inquired. They said that Mercy Anderson contracts out-of-network doctors. And this doctor that worked on him, one of the doctors that worked on him that day, was apparently an out-of-network doctor. But Gail says the reason they went to that hospital was because it was in network. Absolutely. I mean, I was completely flabbergasted. I mean, I never heard of such a thing. You know, we're in a situation right now where we're living on a fraction of our former income. Gail says she complained to that building company that this is just not right, but... They said that they could maybe perhaps um, forgive a portion of the bill or put it on a payment plan. And I, I said, absolutely, I'm not paying this bill. The bill from the out-of-network doctor here at the hospital says the charge was already processed by Brett's insurance company, so it's now his responsibility to pay. Brett's wife is baffled. It doesn't make sense at all. I mean, what's in network? The facility or <laughs> the people, you know, pro providing the, um, the care? So I contacted Mercy Hospital. Officials looked into the complaint and concluded the patient should not be charged for the bill. They then worked with Brett's insurance company and received payment for the emergency room visit. Bottom line, if you go to an in-network hospital, there's really no way to prevent an out-of-network doctor from treating you. So if you get hit with a bill from the doctor, contact the patient advocate at the hospital. I'm told they should get the bill switched to an in-network fee. Howard Ain, Local 12 Troubleshooter. It's great advice for all of us.